another bang. The bang. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on, choir. Not the bang. The bang. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on, Sopranos. Not the bang. The bang. Oh, 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 oh. Come on, Altos. Not the bang. <laughs> Why am I like this? Why am I like this? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Jaya, but you can call me Holly J. And today's video is a chit chat get ready with me. So if you're feeling this little look right here with these bangs, yes, the bang yang, yes, the bang yang. With the curls, just keep watching. We're gonna start with the hair. Um, I took this hair right out of the package. This hair is from Beauty Forever Hair. Um, and they sent me this wig. This is the 16 inch body wave with bangs. Yes, bangs. I feel like it's really cute. Like this hair is super soft, like super soft, super bouncy. Like I love this length um, too, but the bangs, we have to work on these bangs. So like that's what we'll be doing. That's what I need to do. But everything else, I'm pretty pleased with the way that the wig fits, um, the hair. Yeah. I don't know if I want to wear it in its natural state or like put some more curls in it, straighten it. I'm probably not going to straighten it for sure. I really like this volume with the bangs. We just have to fix the bangs because Tay would be so disappointed. Tay would be so disappointed. <laughs> that gets into what I want to talk about today. But okay, let me get into customizing these bangs so we can get into this chit chat. We can get into this makeup look and we can get into this outfit look. Okay, like I said, this hair is from Beauty Forever Hair. All the details will be down below in the description box. So, they're just too long right now. They just need to be a little shorter. But I feel like the body in them is Whopping. I can see y'all, but y'all can't see me, can you? <laughs> nah, this take me back. You know, we used to do the side bang. Okay, 
so I just put my bangs to the side I'm gonna tuck this hair to the back so I can work on my makeup already did my eyebrows um I'm gonna be using Fenty Beauty hydrating the hydrating longwear foundation uh today and I am the color 440 I have both the matte and this one well I had the matte and I got this one I am more dry and I like I like them both the same um I previously was using Juvia's Place and I still do but I feel like my Juvia's Place is for when I'm going out when I'm stepping out and I guess I guess I'm trying to take pictures so I guess I am trying to be a baddie but I was just, but like I want to use Fenty because this is my newer foundation. So, how have y'all been? Because I know I went missing for a minute. And I wasn't even really missing. I had all intentions to um, film and record videos with friends and everything. But it just didn't work out that way. Um, one of the reasons being um, when I went well, let me start from the beginning. I don't know if y'all know or not, but I went home to Tallahassee for like, I want to say about a month and a half in total. The whole month of July, a little bit of June, and a little bit of August um, up there because I'm working remotely and it provides me the luxury of working like that provides me the luxury of work being where I am. So I figured, let me switch locations because, you know, if you know, I live at home and, you know, I love my parents dearly, but I mean, there's only so much we can do together. <laughs> so I just figured I'll go home. My friends ask about me, you know, they always wondering when I'm coming back, if I'm going to come. So I went and I went for an extended period of time, which was great. Um, when I was up there, I was staying in my cousin's apartment and she had came down here so we kind of traded places and it worked out you know pretty seamlessly but um when I was up there I just it had like its challenges um you know her place is obviously not my place and when you film you want to be comfortable and you know the the, the the luxury of having bangs is I really don't have to worry too much about this forehead you don't have to worry about how your eyebrows look too much that's the convenience of bangs i would say this is a very like a bang wig can be a very convenient wig i'm not mad at it and falls on the way bangs be in in the fall for sure then you know for me anyways i don't like to film and it not feel genuine authentic i like to be in the mood you know i wanted to come across because people can pick up on that and i felt like i would give off fake vibes or just like off vibes if i had vlogged while i was up there um i did have all intentions to do more like sit down videos with friends like cool interesting videos that i haven't done on my channel yet but People be saying they want to do something and they don't do it. You know what I'm saying? So it just never really happened. I'm, I'm using the Juvia's Place. This is called the matte. Something like that. I'm using Juvia's Place con Concealer in 11 under my eyes. But yeah, that played a big part in it. Just not feeling, you know, as comfortable as I would if I'm home vlogging like even vlogging out in public in Tallahassee I was gonna feel so weird because it's my hometown and that's just not I don't know I don't see youtubers from my hometown vlogging and stuff and if they are you know I just haven't seen it so I just feel a little out of place doing it Gonna, so what I decided to do, I was just like, I'm just going to enjoy my time back home, you know, enjoy my people, live in the moment, don't be too worried, don't put too much stress on myself because I'm not uploading and things like that. So I just kind of ran with that. I'm actually going to be going, I'm probably going to be going back and forth from home and here up until, you know, I have to be back in the office again because how many times does a pandemic happen <laughs> when you get that luxury? Not often. So, and I didn't get to see everyone that I wanted to see while I was up there. 
and like the situation up there is just better now so I will be able to record and stuff when I go back so it's gonna be I'm giving y'all the heads up I'll be in between changing locations you know the whole thing but I won't go missing like that again because I'll have a little bit more control over the situation when I go back and forth these next times so yeah by the way I am using this sponge that Miss Aaliyah J just kind of put us on to on her last video um, the elf camo concealer sponge pick mine up from Walgreens and I'm giving it a go today I will say this thing is really blending into my skin I don't know if, if uh, my other sponges don't do that but it does allow you to really get into those corners anything drastic about this sponge really I, I mean I will say it blended right in I will say that like it looks pretty seamless right like I need to put another layer on I'm gonna top it with my LA Pro Girl Pro Concealer and you already know Fawn Fawn baby because I'm taking pictures today I realized I should put on a little bit more makeup when I want to be like in pictures and really glam because I usually I do a very natural beat all the time I realize sometimes you know it don't pick up in my pictures so I'm like you gotta have to like overdo it a little bit so that in your pictures you can see your beat like, you can see how beat you are you don't have to be go to waste so I'm realizing I need to kind of like pile it on there a little bit but I used to have a fear that's why I do my makeup so natural like because I used to have a fear of if you do like the most with makeup and if that's your preference that's your preference but for me I was really scared that like I would look totally different with makeup on and then makeup off that was like one of the biggest things for me when I first got into makeup I was like I just don't want it to be like a big drastic change I see it though I've seen it before and I just didn't want that to be me like there's girls out there who have you know dark circles or whatever and I would say I kind of have a uh, my under eye isn't perfect to me but I I try not to conceal it too much because then when you see me without concealer it's kind of like whoa I didn't know that was under there so that's something I used to be like scared about Glam. I think I look the same and that's my whole goal I'm proud of my makeup Tay still being shady like it's old news it's old news at this point and he's still trying to make it a thing who cares I mean we clowned Jonathan already we heard both sides of the story we heard Joe's side and we heard Nikki's side you know people have an opinion at the end of the day um can you move past it because you keep bringing it up like like you severing all ties if there was ever any amends to be made he's really showing his character like i was hoping he wasn't like that but he's really showing his character very much catty very much petty I kind of can already see what kind of person Tay is and that's, that's upsets me because I didn't want that to be that. I felt like he was real genuine and I think, I still think that, don't get me wrong. You can tell he really, when he F with you, he F with you the long way. But you can tell he has a little character flaw in a, in a, it's probably his, he probably has a little possessiveness in him like. When you're mine, you're mine. I mean, you see how he is with R. You see how he is with all his girls. I could just see. It's a little character flaw he has there. And he got to work on that. Because, baby, you, like, just like you know, you had to get your teeth pulled. That means sometimes you're not going to be available when people need you to be available. It's okay. Like, he's tripping. <laughs> he's real deal tripping. I'm just using my air spun. Um, setting powder but under my eyes and then I'm gonna probably I'm gonna put it on my whole entire face too just to set everything y'all when I tell y'all this week my mind 
was just like blown like i can't even i just my mind was blown this week y'all but all that i want to really say is you know energy doesn't lie and i don't know if like it's just me twitter seems to kind of make it seem like more people were feeling this way because you know i be paying attention like when the earth is in certain places with the moon and this and all that like i believe that has an effect on energy behaviors all that and i just want y'all to know energy does not lie she does not lie and that's been proven to me this week and like this whole for a good two to three actually more than that like it's been something that i've felt and i would ignore or not even ignore but just didn't understand what that was so i've been taking a lot of time to understand like what certain energies are trying to tell me and this week my mind was blown by what it was trying to tell me because it was confirmed by like just about everyone that's close to me confirmed this energy and i was just like whoa 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 <laughs> whoa how did i miss this how did i miss this you know the thing that i'm trying to get at with energy is pay attention like when you when you feel things those things are real vibes are real energy is real and when you feel it assess it really try to understand like is that you is it you know and assess it and move accordingly because if you continue to ignore it I feel like that's just like guys like that's what I've been feeling lately is just like more like stronger than ever that I couldn't even ignore and it was just like what is that and I just I turned to the closest people to me and the people that knew the situation and like the close people that know the situation at hand and my mind was blown y'all my mind was blown but just pay attention assess it um understand the severity of it maybe it's not as severe but it's just important to understand what you're feeling and what that is and it provides so much clarity so i don't know if this will resonate with anyone because like i'm not really getting into the details of it but i just want to shed light on the importance of vibes and energy that y'all is real i feel like y'all should be able to resonate with what i'm saying and you know take it for yourself take it as you will <sighs> you guys have you heard the news kayla nicole and travis kelsey aren't together anymore i was super sad to hear that news but i feel like my sis finna get in her bag she about to go hard like she's already she's already pretty like ambitious successful but she's about to like she about to shake it up i already could tell like i could see it but i was really sad to hear that um and there was like false news going around that it was um that he cheated or something but he like cleared the air and was like nobody cheated on anyone this and the third he could be lying but who knows i'm just sad to see it because i was rooting for them i really was and i i root for her. kayla hard love her personality she's she's authentic she's genuine she does not put on for the internet people love her because of all her little imperfections and her quirks and kinks that's exactly why people love her and that's the kind of person i want to be like i want there i want it to show that there is i'm more, i have layers to me um and what you see is not all that you get there's like so much more to me which is why i vlog so much y'all because i feel like y'all really just get to see who i am on a regular degular like that's really me let me give y'all a little uh explanation behind my um my channel name and like why i changed my um handle and everything so my nickname in my family is hollywood so i took holly and the first letters of my name j um and I said that to say, I like to vlog because I want it to be known and seen that there's a reason my nickname is Hollywood. I am this 
creative and energetic, bubbly, bright empath who just is sarcastic and <laughs> loves to laugh and loves and knows how to laugh for herself and I do it all dolo like I'll be in my room y'all y'all barely see other people in my vlogs and you see how I be so just imagine like when I'm in a room full of my loved ones who just like bring that out of me even more it's just like you would really understand why my nickname is Hollywood but I kind of want to tell y'all a little bit of why my name is why my channel name is Hollywood and how and I mean Holly J and why you know I introduced myself as that that's my stage name that's my stage name Holly J really it's Hollywood but everyone calls himself Hollywood so I just wanted to kind of like take a piece of that and a piece of what people would know already and put it together put these lashes on I got these lashes from Walgreens to the lash couture full and fluffy volume they're in chiffon they're by kiss naked drama they're really pretty they're real full I felt like I should get something full because I got these bangs so it should be cute like the little lashes should be blinking with the bangs like I can just see it's gonna be so cute right it's gonna be so cute so let me just put these on real fast and then I'll come back okay so lashes are on and yes these lashes are gonna be like blink approved these are so cute so cute so cute okay I picked up this elf uh waterproof retractable eyeliner in black because I really love the way Shaylin, I think is how you say her name. Um, Jada Chivas is, um, and like Dez, her best friend, they're makeup artists. I love the way she does makeup. And I realized that she really carves out the eyes and she puts liner on the waterline. I barely wear liner. Um, and I'm not big on wing eyeliner, so I'm thinking if I start doing this, my eyes would pop severely. And I really like that look. So I was going to try it. So I realized that y'all ain't streaming City on Lock by the City Girls. And y'all sleep. City on Lock is hard. Them girls are spitting. And I cannot believe y'all not streaming. Like, and they were gypped. Somebody leaked their album. Which I was watching an interview with um, The Breakfast Club and with Ebro in the morning and they had all intentions for that album to be a mixtape but when they were sabotaged it was like okay we're just gonna make up an album and they lost like days of sales and all this stuff and I just feel so bad for them because that project is hard and I'm like realizing that y'all not streaming it cause like y'all captions don't tell me you streaming streaming it. <laughs> I had asked my friends, y'all listen to it, what's your favorite song? They're like, I ain't even listen to it yet. I'm like, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What's up? The City Girls, come on now. Like, JT is free. Y'all didn't listen to the first thing that came out with JT on it? I was just like, wow. Like, so, I'm telling you now, go listen to City on Lock. And girls, it's wrapping they behind off. If you need any starters, listen to Friendly. Listen to Enough. Listen to, I mean, y'all know Kitty Talk. I ain't gonna say that word on my channel. Y'all know Jobs, but them girls are rapping. Mm, y'all sleep. City girls, I got your back. Stream City on Lock right now, period. And then my girl Flo Millie, child. Other rappers got some problems on their hand because Flo Millie is hard. Like, she's hard. Like, rapper hard she don't even sit there and talk about her vagina the whole time sis is hard my day with her record with the um i walk around like that mm, 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 mm. i walk around like that like she says my tone of the day this is who we probably like six times today already like the liner helps also with bottom mascara because bottom mascara don't always like pick up like it should to make your eyes stand out so i like this combination of the two for my lash day okay, so my face is pretty much done now i just want to add some blush and i want to 
add some highlight maybe and put my lip my lip combo on With these lashes, it's gonna be like blink, 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 Get into my lip gloss. What is it giving, y'all? What is it giving? It's giving pretty. It's giving Barbie doll a little bit. Barbie doll with bangs. Black Barbie. Black Barbie with bangs, I think. But these bangs move. That's what I want y'all to get from this. This hair moves. These bangs move. Like, stiff wear. All right, so now I'm going to just put on my press-on nails because I'm taking pictures today. And I just... And we're going to get dressed. And I'll come back with the final look. And... Yeah. So... Stay right there, don't go nowhere. I'm coming right back. I'm coming right, 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 right back. Don't go nowhere. Another bang, the bang. Whoa, 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 whoa. Another bang. This bang pops severely. It's so cute, yes. Stand up and some give it to, some give it to, some give it to, to our girls. Five billion and forty naughty shorty, baby girl, I'm a girl, I'm a girl. Stand up and say, well, come on the way that I'm real street, like a thief in the night. I got the inch in trying to be me. I walk around like that bitch. Here's the outfit for today. We got this black little A-line dress with the little sleeves. It's real cute. And then I picked up my babies. I finally got a hand on my babies. Yes, sir. And I got this little headband from probably just like, I think TJ Maxx. Yeah, TJ Maxx. Cute, cute, cute. I'm gonna add this to the look. It's gonna be so cute, girly, but like, you know, sneakers with dress, but girly headband, real cute vibes. So that's the look we going for. Hey guys, so here's the final look. What do y'all think? I'm trying to find my silver necklace. I don't wear silver often, so I still have my Island Girl chain on, but I'm trying to find my La Icy silver necklace. But this is the final look, y'all. This wig, it's so easy like took it out the box didn't even wash it didn't do nothing now if that's not your thing wash it but took it out um no real weird smell like literally it's like a put on and go like shake and go wig but like virgin hair with these bouncy bangs super cute i can't wait to rock this a lot in the fall when bangs are appropriate because i live in florida baby it is too hot for bangs just like every day but i think this wig is super cute i'll pop some more curls in it but it came body wave like all the body you see in this is from the hair i just kind of curled it so it had some like rhyme or reason but this cute this hair is cute y'all so all of the all the details will be in the description box below and yeah so thank you guys for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe um i just want to say thank you so much for the support that i have i see it all i pay attention people that tweet me people that retweet my videos um people that share my videos people that are telling others to watch my videos 
who if it, the people that just watch the video every time you it's just between me and you i appreciate you so 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 much because i'm seeing the love and the love is real and it just keeps me going because i know i belong here and yeah y'all just like making it even more of a solidified fact so thank you guys so much for watching i'll see y'all in my next one